Hey, well, Bug World Entertainment. And Star Wars is saved, everybody. Yes, because Kathleen Kennedy at Star Wars Celebration in London made announcements of tons of crap that nobody asked for, nobody wants, nobody's looking forward to, and nobody cares. Unless, of course, you're one of the shills who are falling over themselves for this crap. You know, the people who, like, worked their asses off for four years and more to be a Star Wars fan. So, there's a ton of news that's come out. I'll make separate videos, but this one will be the main one with Kathleen Kennedy, who basically had silence when she came out on the stage. <laughs> but she announced tons of crap. She's announced three brand new movies. She's announced more shows. She showed people some footage from shows and whatnot, and brought out cast members and everything else. And now she's trying to spin the hype for Star Wars. So check this out. She is now trying to say Star Wars needs to be and is about quality. <laughs> you mustn't be watching what they're making. Check this out. Lucasfilm president Kathleen Kennedy recently put out a new spin for Star Wars while trying to hype up new films and television programs. Let's not forget, this is the woman who has announced more projects than they've made, has fired more directors than she's had work for her. <laughs> Speaking with IGN's Alex Steedman during Celebration, Kennedy was asked, now I will say this question is retarded. So this dude Alex says, or at least I'm assuming it's a dude, I just want to see if there is any major hope that you want to strive for in this kind of new era of Star Wars that you just announced today. What in the name of Christ question is that? I'll repeat that. I just want to see if there is any major hope that you want to strive for in this kind of new era of Star Wars that you just announced today. Back to the window looking for you, sunshine. But Kennedy's response is equally as retarded. Because she replied, It's as I said, I think quality is always everything. We want to tell resonating stories that really speak to what Star Wars is. By what? Ignoring everything Star Wars is, was and should be. You just abandoned the entire thing, told all the fans, yeah, get fucked. <laughs> That's what she thinks Star Wars is. But she continued. I don't really want it, and none of us want it to become like everything else, she concluded. We want it to be something that continues to live up to the expectation that fans have. And that's the most important to all of us. Um. Okay. The expectation you mean like expectations fans have of Luke Skywalker being the fucking hero, Han Solo being a good guy and a good father. Because I don't remember anyone having expectations of well, I hope Han Solo is killed off in this movie. I hope they also make him out to be a deadbeat dad. And as for Luke, I hope he's just a waste of space. This is the same woman who turned around and said, Galaxy's Edge can't be Tatooine because there's more Star Wars stories ahead of them than behind. Ergo, don't make a Tatooine. 
because we don't want it to be for the 40 and 50 somethings yeah and here she is trying to say we want quality and we want it to be for what the fans are expecting well right now we're all expecting Star Wars to continue to be total and utter shit because it's dead under her leadership and Disney's rule and that's exactly what her expectations are is for that to continue and with what they've announced <laughs> I think our wishes will be granted so that's the first story out wait the next videos I do wait till you hear the crap that they have announced and they're showing and are doing because it is all garbage again unless you're one of them shills who just bends over backwards for Disney because they want that access anyway with that I'll leave there for this one and trust me they think the force is still very much female and with that I'll leave it there for this one cheers catch you in the next one